in the book of Colossians chapter 3 verse 1. The Bible says, If ye then be rising with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ seated on the right hand of God. Mark that word, where Christ seated on the right hand of God. In the book of Isaiah chapter 30 verse 15, the Bible says, For thus says the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, in returning and rest shall he be saved. In quietness and in confidence shall be your strength, and you would not. In Matthew chapter 26 verse 36, the Bible says, Then cometh Jesus with them unto a place called Gethsemane, and said unto the disciples, Sit ye here, where I go and pray yonder. Mark that word, seek ye here, where I go and pray yonder. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point loud and clear. Take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, every close enemy firing arrows into my life and destiny, your time is up. Backfire in the name of Jesus. Every close enemy firing arrows into my life and destiny, your time is up. Backfire, 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 backfire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You're welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV station that will teach you how to interpret your dream with warfare prayers. Are you just watching over the very first time? You are most welcome to the arena of dream interpretation with warfare prayers. I am Evangelist Joshua Ureke, broadcasting from Lagos, Nigeria. If you are not yet subscribed, subscribe today. Our topic is dream about cheers. Dream about cheers. Have you been dreaming about cheers? How often do you dream about cheers? What was the emotion attached to that dream about cheers? Were you actually happy in that dream or you were actually afraid in that dream? Praise the living Jesus. By the grace of God, we are going to look into the spiritual meaning of cheers. Stealing your cheers, you saw cheers flying, you saw broken cheers, wooden cheers, and all rocky cheers, and all kind of cheers. Praise the living Jesus. The, quest, the question is, are you seated with Christ or you are seated with the wrong people? Many people sit down on a chair for many reasons. They sit to rest, they sit to walk, they sit to eat, they sit to talk, to listen, to wait. Chairs are a piece of furniture used for sitting at home, works, etc. Sitting comfortably on a chair can bring rest, comfort, and balance. If you are feeling stressed or tired, chair is the best place to sit. Chairs are very important in our everyday life. Without the use of chairs, we can feel relaxed, comfortable, or organized as a person. Dream about chairs have several symbolism and meanings. Dream about chairs can represent power, authority, control, role, position, exhortation, rest, peace of mind. Chair in dream can also represent God's thrones of grace, mercy. In the realm of the spirit, chairs can represent one seat of glory. It can also represent leadership, independence, burden bearers, concentration, recognition, respect, satisfaction. Cheers is a place of rest. Look at what the Bible says in the book of Matthew chapter 11 verse 28. The Bible says, Come unto me, all will, all will labor and are heavy laden. I will do what? I will give you rest. The rest is the Holy Spirit. The Lord will give you rest in that situation in the name of Jesus. You have labored so much, you have labored so hard, but now you need that rest. You need that rest. As a father or as a mother, you have labor and you are waiting for your children to take care of you. That's the period of rest. Praise the living Jesus. If you are troubled in life, finding a place to sit in dream could be a sign that God is about to calm the storm in your life. Despite the important use of sitting on a chair, some wicked people still use the chair to plant evil against a person's life, destiny, work, or hurt. An evil person may use chair to either steal, kill, and destroy a person's fortunes. fortunes. Some wicked people will put charm on someone or put charm or substance on someone's chair. Once the person sits on that chair, it's either the person will fall sick, die, receive a bad news at work, fire at work, demoted at work, or the person will continue to have failed plans or aborted expectation. In Luke chapter 14 verse 10, the Bible refers to sitting down as a symbol of honor and recognition. When interpreting the dreams about chairs, you need to put into, into consideration the type of chairs, the color of chairs, and also the condition of the chairs. If you are planning to start a business or you are planning to be promoted, this dream tells you to be creative about the way you are handling some things in your career or business. Dream about sitting on a broken chair. It might symbolize the emotions, struggle, blockage, worries, illness, failure. A broken chair may refer to attack, disgrace, loss of power, loss of recognition, unsatisfied life. Dream about sitting down may symbolize it's time to think about your life, think about your career, and begin to take decision immediately. Sitting on the chair in dream may also symbolize your need to sit down and relax. 
It's possible to dream about chair when you are about to entertain a guest. To sit on a broken chair means health problem or type of problem that doesn't give you rest. If you are just sitting in a beautiful chair, that means God has prepared a beautiful place, home, career for you. Think about what God promised to give you. This beautiful chair may also tell you the experience of beautiful life that you will undergo very soon. A chair is linked to gathering, patience, loyalty, humility, etc., which shall tell you the various meaning behind chair. If you dream of broken chairs, what does it mean? This type of dream might relate to your marriage, career, finance, or work. It, might, it means there's going to be disappointment, failure, hurt issue, loss of wealth. That can, see, that can indicate non-achievement, setback, failed plans. If you are breaking a chair in a dream, it means that you are going to have issues with someone close to you. It also shows that you are not going to have rest or peace of mind, God forbid. If you dream of, of two beautiful chairs, what does it mean? It, it, it means it's time for you to engage in a vital or crucial meeting with someone in real life. It could be for a meeting purpose, marriage purpose, etc. Spiritually, dream about two beautiful chairs means it means it means it prepares you to participate, listen, or share your burdens with others because two chairs involve sharing your burdens, having a good relationship with others. The Bible says, "Can two come together except they what they agree?" You want to deliberate and agree on something. That is two beautiful chairs. If you dream of empty chairs, what does it mean? It means that God has a wonderful place for you or a sign that a position has been declared vacant. Spiritually, negatively, it can also indicate that someone has misplaced his rightful position or role in life. This dream might also relate to receiving good news or help from a friend if you have seen empty chairs. If you dream of carrying a chair, what does it mean? If you are carrying your chair, it indicates a symbol of protecting your life and destiny from danger. It's, like, it's likely you are going to experience a big opportunity and success in your works. If you are carrying a chair, it can also represent promotion or transfer to one particular place to another. Praise the living Jesus. If you dream of sitting on a chair, what does it mean? It symbolizes rest, comfort, peace, organize, peace of mind, satisfaction, power, control, patience, glory, a new career, opposition, honor, respect, new decision, a successful talks with someone. If you don't sit comfortably on that chair, it means troubled. If you dream of dirty chair, what does it mean? That is a bad sign. It symbolizes an art of procrastination, laziness, Reluctancy, demotion, complicated issue, discomfort, setback in career, sin, uncomfortable situation, lack of motivation, illness, abandoned project, bad luck. On the other hand, if you are sitting on a dirty chair, it means you will not be you will not be fruitful or profiting from your work as a result of your sin. If you clean it, then you try to remove obstacles and setback or causes blocking your progress. If you dream of clean chair, it reflects your effort to improve the quality of your life and succeed in your endeavors. A clean chair is a representation of good things and blessing in your life. If you are sitting on a clean chair, then it signifies comfort, leadership, security, new beginning, favor, promotion. This suggests a new beginning in your life. Don't worry, God is in control. If you dream of stolen chairs, if you dream of your, your chairs being stolen, what does it mean? It means that your power, your respect, your, your respect, your leadership role or position have been stolen. Or manipulated by the enemy. Unfortunately, you have some people who have conspired to hijack your position and deal with you spiritually. This can make you unstable or face obstacles in life. You might have the ability to be promoted or succeed in life, but the enemies have blocked it, your chances of progress and greatness in life. If you dream of falling from a chair, what does it mean? It symbolizes demotion, stagnancy, difficulties, rising and falling, non-achievement, shame, attack, inability to prosper or excel at work. It represents delay, illness, backwardness, job termination, loss of control, loss of control and direction, falling from grace, falling from grace to grass, impossibility, lack of growth. It can also pass as a message for you to protect your position as a person. Otherwise, the enemy will attack your position. The enemy is trying to pull you down. You have somebody that wants to pull you down from your position, falling from a chair. If you dream of a rocky chair, what does it mean? It's a symbol of power, honor, leadership, comfort, meditation, happiness, retirement, satisfaction. If you are worried in life, this dream tells you to deal with your fear. This dream might denote peaceful and delightful experiences in work or at home. If you dream of chairs in church, 
you are seeing chairs in church. What does it mean? It, this type of dream signifies a call, so winning and worshipping with the saints. It can also suggest that you have many people to educate or impart with your spiritual gift. It tells you to seek the Lord in truth and in spirit so you can be saved from attacks and trouble that stand as obstacles to your life. If you are dreaming of cheers in the dream, dream, talking about church cheers, it can also mean that as a pastor, you have many lives to affect. You have many lives to bring to the kingdom of God. Prepare for it. If you dream of black cheers, what does it mean? In the realm of the spirit, it symbolizes a person's destiny has been a change, manipulated, influenced, change against, his, against fulfilling his major goals in life. That black chair is a signal of sadness, depression, career failure. A black chair in a dream can also mean that you will have to postpone your plans because of the problems bothering you now. Because you are postponing your plans, that good plans, that goal you have set yourself. You are postponing because of that sickness. You are postponing because of that affliction you are passing through. But you never postpone your dreams in Jesus' name. If you dream of arranging chairs, what does it mean? It reflects your desire to solve difficult problems broadening your life. You want to put your life in order. In this case, in this case, you need to be patient to get rid of, of, of that issues of life. Everything will fall into its place very soon. In this case, soon things will start getting better. Don't give up to arranging of chairs in your church. And at the same time, if you see if you see about disorganized chairs, it means that someone's life has been disorganized. If you dream of buying chairs, what does it mean? It means that you will be loved, honored and respected among your friends and family. Everyone will see you as a successful person with great accomplishment. It means that you are going to be rewarded for things you have put into work. That is about buying chairs. If you are buying two chairs, it means that you want to hold an important meeting with someone. On the other hand, if you are selling chairs, it means that you are going to sell your rose, your wealth to a person, God forbid. If you dream of many chairs, what does it mean? It indicates a big career opportunity coming on its way. God is calling you to join a big program that will transform your life and destiny. This could be a church program or a career development. Also, it could reveal your desire to change yourself or to adapt to some new roles in life. If you dream of cheer inside a house, what does it mean? It's a warning, that, it's a warning about some household matters. It's usually a sign that you need to start dealing with some issues around your house or regarding your family before, before they grow into big problems. If you dream of cheers outside the house, what does it mean? It means that you need to take your time off to rest and relax yourself or that bodies. Perhaps you have been stressed up or tired in life. You need to relax and have a sound mind to reflect better on some things going on in your life. If you dream of children sitting on chairs, what does it mean? It's a good moment. It symbolizes happiness in your home. It means you will soon hear good news about someone close to you. This dream means you should live and impart children around and make them happy. If you dream of being offered a chair to sit, what does it mean? It indicates receiving a gift for someone who will turn out to be a very useful to you. This dream, this dream relates to promotion, opportunity, favor await you. Keep praying and keep your faith high. It could also mean that your good deed is making people to give you a special role in life. If you dream of unknown person sitting on your chair, what does it mean? It means that it means someone will deceitfully occupy your position or an enemy sitting on your destiny. God forbid. When something happens, you can't grow succeed or breakthrough in life because there's someone that will disappoint you and obstruct your progress in life. Pray against enemy of progress. If you dream of wooden cheer, what does it mean? It symbolizes wisdom, longevity, respect, freedom, life experiences, comfort, peace of mind. If you are sitting on a wooden chair, it means that you need to apply wisdom when dealing with some issues in life. It's an indication that you are managing the way life comes to you. If you dream of cheer turned upside down. What does it mean? If you dream of cheer turned upside down, what does it mean? It portends job loss and a sign that you will receive a mysterious news from your place of work that will shock and disappoint you. That is a sign of witchcraft done against your life. They have actually succeeded in scattering the work of the works of your hand. If you dream of fighting cheers in a dream, what does it mean? It means the conflict or misunderstanding you are having with someone in real life will be resolved amicably. Praise the living Jesus. If you dream of wheelchair, what does it mean? It means you're unable to do things on your own, which has incapacitated you. Hence, you need assistance from others to achieve your aim in life. You may feel you are relying on, on others so much. It might mean you are not taking things by faith 
or you are depending on, on other people too much. If you are pushing a witch here in the dream, it means that you are assisting or encouraging ones to have faith concerning his or her situation. If you dream of sitting on a chair inside the river or ocean, what does it mean? It means that you have been specially given a role in a water kingdom. That can affect many areas of your life and destiny. This means that you will have fame, power, wealth, and, and you will use your beauty to entice men. But all these, all these things, all this wealth, all this power are given to you by marine powers, which is starting as a possession in your life. Go for deliverance and dispossess any title given to you in the water. You are sitting on a chair in the dream, in the water. It's not good, yeah? You have been simply given you a role in the marine kingdom. Go for deliverance. If you dream of someone putting charms on your, on your chair, what does it mean? That's an attack from a, from a known person against your life and destiny. Be vigilant. Someone wants to harm you in many ways and put affliction in your life as a way of punishing you. Many people have died or fall ill or lost their job as a result of this dream attack. Lastly, if you dream of flying chair, what does it mean? That is a bad sign. If nobody is in a chair, it warns you that you should undo your private affair carefully. Otherwise, the enemy might sack you in the place of your power, authority, and prosperity. If someone is in that chair while flying, it means you will enjoy the freedom to rise and succeed and prosper. You have been dreaming about chairs. What are the ways? Number one, give your life to Christ. Two, ask God to give you a good position in life. Three, cry out to God to take away your burdens and give you rest. Four, cancel any evil plans against you and your career. Five, draw closer to God. Draw closer to God so that He can secure a good place for you. Six, study the word and pray until something happens in your life. Seven, rebuke any setup or conspiracy. Eight, cover yourself. Cover yourself. Cover yourself, your home, and your career with the blood of Jesus. Instruction, embark on seven days fasting and prayer from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, every power that is occupying the seat of my glory, receive the arrow of death in the name of Jesus. Every power that is occupying the seat of my glory, receive the arrow of death in Jesus' name. Say, every charm of voodoo placed on my seat to subdue my glory and demote me. Backfire, backfire, be neutralized. Backfire, be neutralized. Backfire, be neutralized. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, enemy, any enemy of progress that want to bring me down at all costs, die, die, die. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, any power that does not want me to have rest or peace of mind in life, oh Lord, disgrace them in the name of Jesus. Any power that does not want me to have rest or peace of mind in life, oh Lord, kill them. Any power that's not want me to have rest or peace of mind in life, oh Lord, kill them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, blood of Jesus, protect the works of my hand, position and wet from, from the attacks of darkness in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Wow, what a wonderful revelation about cheers. Wow, wow, position rose. I pray the Lord will give you position. You will sit on the right hand of God. If you have been seated on the wrong position, the Lord will pull you out from that wrong position. If there's anybody that is contesting with that position, I pray they will fail. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you have not yet, if I have not yet shared your dream about cheer, write them at the comment, comment section. If you are not yet subscribed, subscribe today. Once again, this is Evangelist from Lagos. Mm -hmm.